hello and welcome back. So I decided that uh, Maya should be part of the party. Also, uh, something to keep in mind is that not all companions are considered full companions. They are not all uh, as fleshed out. So I'm using these companions now. Only these four plus uh, Takehu. We can well, actually we can check it out. Takehu plus a lot plus Paladina apparently are the full companions of the game and uh, every other uh, follower or companion it's more like a well cl it's closer to adventures that you can just hire in the taverns despite Behold, may, may perhaps having uh, uh, something to say at purpose. first but uh, they don't really have that uh, much conversation after that <clears throat> apparently anyway I want to give a May a shot anyway, so let's talk with her. I should come clean about something, Captain. Maya scratches the back of her head, sighing. Is is this where you betray me, Maya? Whoa! So uncalled for. Right away, speak your mind. Atsura didn't set me loose just so I could stay busy. Fact of the matter is, he gave me a job to do. To spy on me. I've got this stack of missives I need to deliver. Noble errand, right? She shows you a small collection of scrolls in her pack, all judici judiciously sealed with the sigil of the Royal Deathfire Company. Okay. You, why, why you give it to me? <clears throat> the company has a lot of people working away from headquarters, and Atsura trusted me to get these in the right hands. I, I hope see that isn't a problem. No, no, no. I see that we make the deliveries in good time. What's in these missives? Aren't you a little overqualified for courier work? Yeah, exactly. Is this some kind of ploy to gain my trust? Watch out, Ishii. We've got a charmer on our hands. Maya plays a whispering to her bird, though she wears a knowing smile. Imagine that as like a way to establish trust. You uh, give away something apparently of value. You trust somebody with a bit like some letters in this scenario. <clears throat> but in reality, they are completely useless. I know, not exactly revolutionary, but I got my eye on you, Maya. That's the thing about Atsura. He keeps so many irons in the fire at once that everything seems like a high priority. Um, what's in these missives? A bit of everything. Shipping manifests, requisitions for supplies, work orders. Mostly work orders. You wouldn't believe how much paperwork it takes to run a navy. I ran a grand estate for a time, I have an idea. Oh, come on. Stop bragging about that. Actually, saying that I ran the estate bit of an overstatement. I see that we make the deliveries in good time. Anything else I should know about this job of yours? More like anything else I should know about you? Anything else I should know about it? Reaching back to tighten her bun, Maya takes a moment to consider your question. Don't take it personally if I'm vague on some of the details. Atsura likes his discretion, even when it comes to boring bureaucratic stuff. You literally gave me the letters. I'm keeping an eye on you. As long as it's nothing I should worry about, exactly. The second that I need you to worry, you'll know. Count on it. She closes one eye and makes a friendly trigger pulling motion at you. Uh oh. This one's bound for Harama, an acquaintance. Good sailor. He's somewhere off in Tikawara. <laughs> She nods up a single scroll. And these are for Tuaha, an old friend stationed in Port Maje. You meet some strange types in the Navy. Let's be off. I guess that's that. We gotta go. You were the bright. So we have a lot of quests. And before we head out, we might wanna complete some of them. Po Pokokuhara is definitely not one of those things. Archimage's Vault in Perky's Overlook. I'm thinking comes for us all. that mission this is much. way overdue. <clears throat> Who's ready to bust into 
apparently let me. Okay, we went the wrong way. <laughs> but we're getting there. Who's ready to bust into the the mage's uh, castle? Some of these uh, are relevant, or I just don't want to do them. Like we have, for example, get the sailors to leave. I, I don't really want them to leave. Maybe we can. Maybe we can attempt that be before we go on the mission. I know where they are. Also about the other mission, I have no idea. Apparently, like I'm listing by location here, <clears throat> and we gotta find the pirate gang that mugged Dora. I have no idea where they are. I'm sure I can look it up, but maybe gonna get some intel about intel on it later. So, wild mare upper floor, shrimp. My Arua. The sailor's eyes bulge. He prods his cohorts with an elbow and a shush. They all stand at attention. Didn't think I'd find you in Queen's birth, did ya? At ease, soldier. Maya clasps her hands and squares her stance. Uh, apologies, ma'am. We promised to behave this time. Swallowing, he looks over to you and nod. What are you doing? The captain gave us extra coin to occupy ourselves while we're on leave. We've been draining Valian wine cellars and trying to remember the words of Rawatai anthems. <laughs> Loudly, as often as not. Wait, what? So I already decided to not help. Not help them. Hmm. I can go back. Martino. So, okay, I guess I'm not gonna hurt them, I don't know. We can attack them, but that's the only way uh, we can do anything else. Well, we can do uh, anything with them at this point. I already told them that, ah, eh, you guys can stay. Yeah, I kind of meant it. But I'm a little bit bugged at the quests. Well, I don't know, I don't really don't mind that... Uh, uh, we have <clears throat> quests that are not obvious. So we can go to Perikis Overlook. To the Dark Cupboard. That's another mission we uh, completed. You see a billowing cloud of smoke behind the houses ahead of you. What? Okay. And that's not what I expected whatsoever. In the higher reaches of Nekataka, slanting shanties and buildings of foreign design fall away to be replaced by colorful, open homes with wide wooden doors boasting intricate reliefs. Rather than pester you for a bit of coin or a bite of food, the children here try to sell you tickets to a play or extol the benefits of the public baths. That's... Nice, I guess. You turn a corner and plunge into commotion. One of uh, the great homes crackles before you, completely ablaze. Most of the Huana stare, enraptured by the flames, but a few cry out or run for the fire brigade. What kind of ability requirement is that? Let's examine the house. Well... You do it. The home seems no different than others in the district, though perhaps a bit larger than average. Bright blue paint uh, flecked with white ac accents peels over sturdy stone, where it hasn't already been blackened by the fires. The large front doors are open, coughing smoke into the streets, and you think you can make out shadowy movement within. <clears throat> Fresh torches lie on the eaves above. It seems this was the work of arsonists. Freezeability. Put out the torches with frost magic. Let's do it. Well, you can do it. Uh, let's do chill fog. Your fingers and lips uh, twist alike as you coax the local essence into a frigid spell. The powerful blast of cold 
extinguishes the torches, leaving a slick coat of rime on the eaves around them. But the flames have already spread into the depths of the home. Like a taka likes me. Let me go in! You plunge through the open doors, an arm raised protectively over your mouth. Smoke surrounds you, and the heat plucks at your skin, curling your hair. Then you see the bodies. Well, my my spell may have killed them. <laughs> Maybe I'll just go out the uh, door and people will ask like, Hey, why are these people, uh, like, frozen? <laughs> I was like, you know, the gods work in mysterious ways. <clears throat> Sprawled out in the main room are three corpses. Two lie on the floor, uh, wounds from small tin blades still oozing blood. A third is draped over a long, low chair, her body punctuated by a crossbow bolt. Investigate for clues. Uh, you investigate. <clears throat> a faint trail of bloody footprints mark a path toward uh, the back of the house. I guess it's good to have high perception. Search f for the presence of spirits. Loot the bodies. You open your watch's senses, seeking the presence of spirits. You feel the pain buffeting you, the stabbing agony of blades biting into your skin, the heavy strikes of crossbow bolts. You hear footsteps, the galat bastards who killed you fleeting through the back door. Let's loot the bodies. It seems someone got the bodies before you. Their purses have been cut from their belts, their jewels roughly torn from their fingers and ears. Pursue the arsonist out the back. You burst through the back door onto an almost abandoned street. A group of ragged kid holding torches are the only people present. You note one of them holds a bulging sack stained with blood. One of the kid, a broad-shouldered human in tight-fitting mask, skulls. Got ourselves a hero, seems. Sally for you. The boss were clear on us, leaving no witnesses. Grinning, the thugs draw their weapons, spreading uh, to surround you. Back off, assholes! The boss sent me to make sure you idiots don't stand around gawking at the bonfire. <laughs> That's funny. That's bluff and shady. I can f forget everything I saw here for a price. <laughs> This is for the people in the house? I'll just kill them. <laughs> it's, this does seem like something that they would fall for. Because the boss uh, uh, surely disrespects them. Kill the witnesses and scatter. Oh. Okay. okay, not double speed. Oh, I like it. That That's a good positioning. What kind of weapon are you using? Lowered their armor. That's perfect. So they have lower deflection. Our chance to hit is 100%. That's amazing! So, this is good. What about this bird? Do I need to tell it to be not dumb? Oh. Oh, he's dead. This is probably a easier engagement. What are you gonna do about your injured situation? Why is she so black? Just unusual. Lame blight. Alright, pretty good. Um, 
find stuff. Yeah, that's kind of what I expected. A lot of uh, crappy low-level gear that we don't care about. Fine saber, fine wand. That's actually interesting. That's fine club, fine mail armor. Yeah, that's crappy. So this is it. I wanted to kill them. <laughs> Just because you can't talk doesn't mean you... Uh, you want to go for that approach. But the key point is... It's not about always going for the diplomatic approach. But having the option to go for that. And that's the important part. <clears throat> Alright. What? You come up on a busy city circle? How many encounters am I going to have? The cool waters of Nekataka... Nekataka's town well serve poor and rich alike, yet those who gather at them share certain unmistakable features. Tired mana, uh, visages, yokes borne across labored backs, and tattered ruparu rags. Yeah. Whether <clears throat> for themselves or their masters, each waits in a long line to claim a bucket full of fresh water. Speak with the locals. The Roparu, long accustomed to ignoring their superiors, pay you little mind, only belatedly realizing that you address them. One of them, an older woman, blinks uh, dark eyes at you. Akira! <clears throat> Damn. Why does everyone sound like Yoda? Damn. No, no, not... A <clears throat> Akira, it is Watcher. I'm always hearing stories of you. The Kara, the Kataka, good one, who wanna good? Yeah, that's because I, uh, I'm, I'm a good guy. It is said you're a decent person. A younger man chimes in. Well, th this is really hard to <laughs> do their voice. I, I can do a lady voice in the first place. Not like so many of the foreign sort. A child reaches for your hand. Yeah. With growing cascade of murmurs, the crowd unravels between you and the now bubbling wellhead. A black liquid splatters from between the stones of the well, and someone in the crowd screams. A mockman from the Roparu cast steps forward. His boots seem more slashed than leather, but his plungers, so long, would fit in with any formation of pikemen. <clears throat> He raises a hand to the curling crowd. Be at ease, Akara. For what do you flee? I'm always... am cleaning these. He blinks as the undulating formlessness of a noose bubbles up from the well. He takes a step back. Well, I'm not feeling thirsty anymore. Draw your weapon and attack? What? Why am I having these options? Nekataka, moderately negative if I flee. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, the ooze. It's actually a ooze is an opponent. Stand my ground. No, I I'll take care of this. The Oman drops his plunger and bolts ungainly on uh, shoddy boots. You turn to see a second thick ooze burst out of the valve. Shredding the well's yoke and scattering the pit stones. Why I wanna freeze the oozes? Yeah, we're gonna gotta kill the oozes. Obviously. There's, we're not gonna freeze the oozes. That's what they like. We killing the oozes. <clears throat> Murder is the right choice, guys. Oh. Those look disgusting. Can you nail it? Should I hit a fireball onto them? Who are you shooting at? Now you be right screwed. You see that 
Yeah, that's a that's a lot of oozes. Okay, you're trying to do another spirit, but you have a spirit. I may need to fix that. That's just bad AI. So, only do one spirit. And what kind of uh, duration does it have? Like, a long time. I'm not sure if there's a condition that, hey, do you have an essential phantom? Yes or no? I don't think there is a condition like that. What? Why so many uses? Can I make AI changes? While the fight is going on. Now when it comes to conditions. I don't think there's gonna be like one that. Oh you have essential phantom. Uh, then yeah. I think it's gonna be. Uh, always true. With essential phantom. But it's gonna have a. Yeah it's nearest target. Nearest enemy. Uh, where the hell is it? Do I have the right thing selected? It's enemy. Nearest target. And it's gonna have a, a, a cooldown of 50. It's gonna get moved up. It's gonna get kicked from there. It's always true. Done. Right between the eyes. Duration 55 seconds. Yeah, sure. Sweet redemption. Another withers on the vine. Whoa! How did we die? Did you actually die? Oh he actually died. Can we rest here? No, we can only wait in this area. Then never mind that. No, oh, oh just a bunch of common folk dead. Can take their stuff, but it doesn't really matter. These people that don't too care tall. about freezing. They only care about real solutions, like murder. That's a real solution. <clears throat> anyway, well, let's get out of this place. So, Peric is overlook. Yeah, we can check out the ship. Actually, we might need to get more sales, food and drink. Milk, for example. Yeah, they like milk. Cuttlefish. Great. So, we can head out. Kind of. I can put water there. Okay, looks like it's possible. Alright, let's just go to Perky's Overlook. The same place I wanted to go for a long time. Also, we might need to keep in mind the uh, the shopkeepers. <clears throat> Some of them actually have uh, good stuff uh, that are truly worth considering. I'm not sure if I'm ever gonna be best buds with the Valiant Trading Company. Also, because of uh, because it's a top-down game, sometimes it's uh, easy to forget. Uh, like. Like the, what? Easy to uh, think of murder differently, I suppose. You don't see it as close up. You just like a strategic guy up top. So I definitely try to. Well, we'll try to even more so get into it. But sometimes murder is the right choice. Anyway, Fasina, I think we got your gloves. You're back. Cool. Any news? I'm afraid Bertano is dead. No, he's not. I got Bertano out of trouble. He's going to hide with the Principi. Ah, at least with the Principi I give him a fighting chance. I, I suspected that uh, you like that guy still. The Sina trails off with concerned waters. But Rawatai has a long reach. She cradles her 
chin stares off into the distance. Um, you're welcome. That's honest. Bertano has a head start in any case. Yeah, that might just comfort you. May he get smart and lie low. He's dumb. He's super dead. What of the gloves? What happened to them? I have it right here. Ah, oh, we lost At it. At least I know Arkimir won't feed me to the imps. She folds the gloves with care and stows them away. Take your discount as well. If the cupboard doesn't make its goals, so be it. Show what you got. You have anything good? Exceptional stuff. That's not what we want. We want legendary. Sasha's singing scimitar. Action speed bonus for each health chanter phrase. Yeah, that's for chanters. It's superb. Ring of Folk's Flame. Accuracy with fire attacks. That's very interesting. The Tundra's Devotion. Superb medium shield. What spell catch? Cash. Summons a random scroll into an empty quick slot at the start of combat. The scroll disappears when combat ends. But random could be completely garbage. So, why is this grimoire so good? Oh, volatile casting? Damage causes an interrupt, grants extra spell casts. Wait, what? It does? Like, how much? <laughs> Come on! You can't just say that. And Damn. we don't know. <sighs> Do you look anyway. for something in particular? I need to get inside Archimedes Manor. Imp, go hang laundry. She holds up a finger for silence, her gaze following the shop imp as he flutters mo moodily away. I'm only doing this for how you help Bertenno. She lets out the heavy sigh and slips a key from her pocket. Here, burn Archimir's manor down for all I care. What? Why are you concerned about the gloves if you, you are letting me uh, burn his manor? Well, thanks for that. What else do you need? Farewell. Uh, should we check out the living quarters? Damn. I'm really curious about that book. I don't care too much about the interrupt. I don't be supposing we kid uh, swapped in sparkling. Health restore by six seconds. That could be okay. Don't care about that. Yeah, th that's a very minor effect. Cena's journal. Oh. This gives us a clue as well. Fine robe. Anyway, so we can go in uh, the front door and also uh, the back door as well. Kuaro Trader. Yeah, we gotta go. Archimir's Manor. The big heist begins. If we're gonna find a special uh, book. It's gonna be there, so... I'm looking forward to that. Are there books that give more than two spells uh, per level? I don't know. I, I think the whole wizard thing is... is uh, very thirsty. interesting. Drink, <laughs> in uh, pillars. Wait a second, can I go in? Yep, I can just go in the main door. <laughs> Ah, <laughs> oh, this is perfect. But I guess this means that when we are finished looting the manor, we just have to 
locked the uh, door behind us. So, uh, Fasina doesn't get in trouble. Yeah, I guess we take that. Uh oh, wow, impact nowhere. I don't wanna hit, hit you, little buddy. Oh, ironclad constructs. I hate these guys. Can I just expose their vulnerabilities? Damn it, got away. Never you mind that myth. Why are we not using any skills? Oh boy, there's gonna be double flannel flames. Can we just rotate around a little bit? Can't get a clean hit. I like the idea of that. Did it work? Yeah, it works. Oh, their vulnerabilities are already exposed. Okay. This thing isn't doing the job. So we're taking them down one by one. And we are definitely making more progress than we did last time. Can we truly hope to charm them? It works. Be hitting the water. Let's go. Okay, we're definitely making good progress here, considering how tanky they are. Seventy-seven. You gotta take it out. What kind of perception of shock armor rating? Can't get a clean hit. Do I care about charming yet? I don't. I don't care too much. That was about as useful as a bump on a pickle. What the hell is this move? After him. Can't do it. No. I don't think so. No penetration. Can't get a clean. Can we uh, improve work. that? Yeah. No. I don't think so. I'm with you. Too slow. Let's go. That dog won't ha! work. Too slow. Who's prowling, gay? Eh? That was about as useful as a bump on a pickle. After him. Yeah. Looks like Zimp is coming in. Leave it to me. I don't think so. Let's Still go. got it. Make a dent. Blast the frost. Might as well be hitting the water. Yeah, I think we did level up. Won't work. That was about as useful as a bump on a pickle. Okay. Sure. Tough fight. Very tough fight. Why master need bucks? Not even taste good. We got trouble. <gasps> Imp is down. Uh, say your prayers. Oh, no, <laughs> yeah, the AI is more set up for medium to uh to lengthy fights. Okay. Okay. Archimir's Labs. Rice vine. Why not? Can't do it. But because we can deal with the golems, I think we are just fine here. Anything this uh, house can throw at us? So 
we can go to the lab or the upper floor and uh, I think we have an unfinished business in the lab. Clearly. Uh, we went there last time. I'm not exactly sure if it's the lab, but we were at the we were in the basement, uh, killing some uh, ironclad golems. It was not going very well, but regardless, that's what we were doing. Yeah, partially explored. Sure. I think I left one golem. At least. Leave it to me. Yeah, we need the proper key for that. I think we have one golem. Here. At least one golem. Why can I see the the crate? Nightcap. Yeah. My fingers be fat and furry, easy breezy, wet ten. Nice. Yeah, lockpick is just a must-have. Saru Sheer. Uh, exceptional. Poison dipped. Wow, that's really good. Zero coral damage per zero seconds for zero seconds. On hit. Not bad. Maybe it scales with the character. That's three. No, it's... It's just not the best enchantment. I have to make... <laughs> I have to note. Okay. <laughs> A lot of bugs. Screw that. We need no books. We need loot. Yeah, there can get in. Go, knock him down. Need something stronger. What for, Captain? No penetration. Yeah, that seemed to be a major problem. Can't get a clean hit. We already used up so many skills. That was about as useful as a bump on a pickle. Can't make a dent. Yeah, we gotta kill it. Don't run away, mister. Oh, I don't mind that. Kill the other construct. God damn it. Got away. Can't make a Let's go. You're going for the charm? Does this thing have a... A little bit lower accuracy than the Puppet Master, but basically the same thing. Hit me again and I'll hit you back. Come on. Ah, Construct, you need to die. Can't make a dent. Let's go. Charming is so insane. No Can't make a dent. That, right? What is he doing? That was about as useful as a bump on a pickle. Question mark. Not charmed anymore. He's charmed again. That's the best disable in the game. Wow, 38 damage. And he's dead. 
Yeah, but these things don't really have good gear. Purge order. This slab looks intended for Alchemir's iron constructs. You sense a fractured, confused scrap of soul essence. Read the soul. You walk through the halls of Alchemir's manor. The layout is no stranger to you, and you navigate every turn with confidence. Your partner is your shadow, hanging three steps behind you. Gesture for him to hurry. A little noise won't disturb the imp stewards. Ifrin nods and hastens his pace. You reach a heavy walled door. The lock is made of gems set in the, to, into, the, in, into stone. Ifrin is glancing over his shoulder, too preoccupied to follow your careful motions. Set the gems into their combination and pray that you, your contact got it right. Just as the wall door grinds open, one of Alchemir's imps runs the, runs the corner and screeches in a full voice. You spit on your heel and make a run for it. Ifrin is nowhere to be seen, but a whisper of clouds through an open doorway tells you where he's gone to hide. Before you can take your second step, a blow like a... A battering ram carries you off your feet, disoriented and prone. The last thing you see is uh, the fist of an ironclad construct mercilessly coming down, with nothing but your head between it and the cold stone floor. I'll be damned if I let a soul be used for such foul means. Come with me now, you poor lost thing. Expression Graham sorry draws her lantern back and forth over the guts of the construct, absorbing the thief's remaining essence. Well, sure. You can have that one, Sodi. And many more. <laughs> oh boy! What did I walk into? Maybe you should go back. Uh oh. Well, that's not a bad position. Team Tricksters. Can we just uh, save Seraphim? Do you care? Where are you? For some reason, running. Alright, oh, that heal is just crazy. Okay, bouncing missiles. Trickster, you want to die? Yep, dead. Leave it to me. Hmm. Okay. So what's over here? Well, let me guess. Even more enemies. Uh. Nothing. Your skin tingles as you approach the scrying pool. Your reflection uh, grins up at you from the depths. Hmm. Archimir's manner is uh, quite weird. So we need the proper key for that. Do we have the proper key? Have someone tinker with the panel, see if anything works. Wait, I can't do it. After, after some gentle attention with a practice hand, a soft click and arcane fizzle erupt from the lock. Seraphim surveys the job well done with a satisfied smile. 
Rotate the gems to experiment with various positions. Enter the combination you found. You rotate the gemstones into their intended configuration. The sound of grinding stone uh, builds in volume as the door moves aside. Perfect. This is the vault. Why even have fancy? Uh oh. Dinnerware if you're just gonna keep it locked up. <laughs> that's, that's an excellent question. That guy is obviously crazy. What if we here? I might just need to. What if? Okay. Auto pause. Let's go with that. Save changes. Okay. We here. So if you see a trap, what did you yeah, then everybody stops. What did you Always. What did you find she? Else they're just gonna run into the bloody trap. I always have to tell them what? to uh, stop here. moving. What if? I don't be spacing weak here, dear. And any other traps I need to know about? Nope. Okay. I don't be sparkling. Oh, this is what I expected. Actually there's nothing here. What? It does look like a special book, but it's not. Well, that's fine. Powerful enchantment. Keep those uh, gold bars way to the spot. Blessed incense. Okay. I don't really use those. Power surge. Boost power level for the duration of the fight. Once per rest. Okay. What else we got? Golden shelling. Harapo epic. <laughs> we, well, we don't gotta read that garbage. I don't. Um, once per rest. I, I just totally expected uh, like a big haul, but apparently that's not the case. Cabalist Gambeson. It's an exceptional light armor that gives armor rating against spells. That's not that particularly good. Is this all you got, Archimir? I'm disappointed in you. There's some big you wizard. Your party and this is it? This is garbage. Even that book you have locked up. It's terrible. Am I right? I think I'm right. Doesn't seem to have any... Uh... Any extra tricks. Minagout's teachings. Did I lose any skills? Hmm. I think I may... I don't know. What is that? Death ray. Oh, do we have the fireball? We don't have the fireball. We have shadow flame. Oh, we got some... Wow, does is it even a, a spell? Uh, you can learn. Current of flame, like Dinagout's shadow flame. I don't know about it. I think we may have access to some. Uh, yeah, Dinagout. Unusual abilities. In this book. Anything that has Ninagout in it. Ninagout's Shadow Flame, Ninagout's Death Ray, Accuracy, Ninagout's Bitter Mooring. We might. That might be a real thing. I don't know. I don't know. Whatever. It doesn't really matter. I usually go with the spells I, I like anyway. Got it. And guys, uh. That's it for now. Thanks for watching and see you next time.